Welcome to a short tutorial on the 3D Mark benchmarking tool. This video will show you where to get a demo version of 3D Mark and how to benchmark your system with it. Finally, we will show you how to compare your system with others. 3D Mark has been around forever and is remembered by younger and older enthusiasts alike. If you have Steam installed on your machine, getting 3D Mark is as easy as pie. Simply go to store on Steam and search for 3D Mark and click on the full version. Don't worry, you can get a free demo which is fully working and more than enough for almost all purposes. After you've downloaded and installed it, you can simply launch it and you will be greeted with the simple starting interface. There are two options being shown. The one that interests you the most is of course the run option. You can also see your system on the bottom and you can also unlock more benchmarking tests. Those are not really necessary though. When you select the benchmarks tab on the top, you can run the so-called TimeSpy benchmark. It will take a little amount of time to set itself up and collect system info and will eventually load up the first scene. It will now play a scene with all sorts of imaginable details. Don't worry, it's sped up for the purpose of this video. There are ultimately four scenes which are being used to benchmark your system. Again, all of them are sped up, it's just to give you an idea what they look like. The juicy part now is the result page. Please note that when you record the scenes, the overall benchmarking score will be skewed to the lower end. While recording the scenes, I got an overall score of 6154 points. I get an additional 500 points when I'm not recording. The good thing about 3 d Mark is that all of the benchmarks that have been run are checked, whether they are valid or not. And then they are uploaded to their database. The database is huge and you can see where your system ranks up against other systems. In my case, I'm still better than a 2020 gaming laptop, which is good, since I only have a 4790K processor and a 1080 GTX GeForce graphics card. Still, there is a lot more room to improve. I'm eventually still better than 52% of all benchmarks, which is not too shabby for a basically 6 year old CPU and a 3 year old GPU. You can also see how you fared in the different benchmarking categories, aka the seats. Please take note that it is advised to not have anything running while you're benchmarking your system with 3D Mark. Anything can lower your score, that is using up CPU or GPU cycles. So close all browser games and everything that is not necessary to run the benchmark. It will give you the best estimate of how good your system actually is. Finally, we hope this video gave you a good idea of where to get and how to use 3D Mark. Leave a like if this is the case. Also comment down below with your benchmark score and link to your results. If you've made it this far in the video, please also consider subscribing to help the channel. We'll see you in the next one.